That Katie will school choice deadlines are here for Duval County students and this affects more than 120,000 students within the county and that means parents need to make sure that you have your decisions in by the deadline. Let's get right out to on your size Leah Shields. She has the details you need to know this morning. Well, good morning. All public schools in Duval County will be open tomorrow on a Saturday for tours. Four tour times available, 9, 10, 30, 12, and 1, 30. Now we can go in the schools, check them out, see if they're what you're looking for for your kid. And a little heads up here, if you're thinking you might want your kid to go to a magnet school, you can actually get higher on the priority list to get in if you go to one of these tours. Choice is very, very important, and it empowers the family, it empowers the child. Sharwanda Peak is the Assistant Superintendent of School Choice. In this building, she helps parents figure out what school is best for their kids. The choice is yours, between your zoned school or a magnet program, some focus on college readiness, some on the arts, and more. A well, student might be interested in entering the medical field, so like Darnell Cookman would be a great choice, and that's a 6th through 12th grade school, and uh, students will be able to learn if, hey, the medical field is for me, and I always tell parents, that's free. You don't have to pay for that. You could also transfer your child to a different school based on location. Maybe a school is closer to your work and easier for drop-off and pickup. And tomorrow, schools are opening their doors to families to see what they're all about. We want everybody on that pavement, crossing the thresholds, um, visiting our schools on Saturday, January 7th. The school choice deadline is February 28th, so you do have some time to finalize that decision. And if you re require public transportation to get to school tomorrow, JTA is actually going to be having some bus routes available to make sure all families have access to these school tours. I'll have all that information at firstcoastnews.com. Leah Shields, First Coast News, on your side.